Hi and welcome to WW Girl Talk, I'm Carol. I'm Ashley. And right now we're reviewing Fast Lane 2016. Woo! Now you said 15. Okay, so as you know, on every pay per view we do, we have a forfeit. So and on, if you saw our predictions, you'd know that we bet on who we thought was going to win each match. And uh, the loser this time around has to fill their face with these. So these are marshmallows. How big are they? Do you want to show them how big they are? They're quite we've, big actually. We've got a lot of packs just in case. They come in pink and white. These are like, that's a pink one, it looks white though. It does look white. Yeah. These are like some of the most famous marshmallows like ever, aren't they? Yeah. Like, we're in England anyway. And uh, they're yummy. Very sugary. I was about to say salty. Powder. I thought it was very salty. <laughs> yeah, that's how we have our marshmallows. Yeah, we have salty marshmallows. <laughs> anyway, so you know the game Chubby Bunny. We're going to put them in if we can in our mouth. And then the loser has to review the next one. Well, kind of. Yeah. Okay. Two on the hundred fucking Do we have to keep them in? Or do we have to... How does it... How, I don't right. know how this works. <laughs> Chubby Bunny is just... Yeah, but you can't eat them, can you? No, but we can eat them, so we can just review while we're trying to get them. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, because otherwise we're just going to be standing there with, like, with salivary marshmallows, mm. like... Mm -hmm. <laughs> we got three bags, just in case. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. Right, should we get cracking? Yeah. Um, we will admit that we did forget what we actually predicted. Yeah. We watched was, our predictions video, it was terrible. <laughs> we don't even think we told you who one of them was, so we guessed him. Yeah. But... <laughs> no, I can't even do it to one of them. Go on. Um, I forgot what I was going to say now. But, um... Great marshmallows. So yeah. Good. It's basically good to quickly eat marshmallows mm. and talk. Oh yeah, we're behind because we're both very busy at work, so... Oh, yeah. And I'm poorly. Yeah. And I've got a move flat, so. Oh, that's so. Mm. Chris, get cracker that in. Um, I thought you were that wrong. I was like, I'm sure you pressed the right <laughs> thing, but I did it wrong. I did it wrong. Uh, first of all, <laughs> I forgot how to do this. We had Sasha Banks and Becky Lynch versus Naomi and Tamina. Now, I said, well, I think we both said Sasha Banks and blah blah, Becky Lynch, but we had to flip a coin, mm -hmm. and I got Sasha Banks and Becky Lynch. And I got Naomi and Tamina, I nearly forgot who she was playing with, and I was like, oh, exciting! <laughs> you know, to be fair, I was not looking forward to the match. I was quite surprised at first. I thought yeah. they would have opened with a much bigger one. I thought they would vote with the men. But to be fair, it was actually quite good. Yeah, it wasn't that long. I thought it was really long. It was about like 10 minutes. Was like 10 minutes? Something like that, yeah. It's one of the shorter matches of the night. Yeah. But it was a good match. I could have done with longer. To be fair, they were, they were wrestling like male tag teams. Yeah. Which is good, which is good. So it was it was a good match and probably one of the best matches of the night, to be fair. Yeah, it's good. Do you know, I can't really remember half the other matches, but I still remember that one. Yeah. Last name's like a month ago. <laughs> We've had roadblocks since. I still haven't watched that. <laughs> sure, I watched it, right? I'm going yeah. off topic, sorry. It was good, but nothing happened. Do you think it's because it's on the network? Like, nothing, like when they went But it felt so pointless. Like, a lot of people said that, though. Like, it was meant to be like a game changer. Yeah, yeah. It was good wrestling. It's better than that wrestling you see on Raw and SmackDown. Oh, that's good. But it felt really pointless. I'm pretty sure I'm on the SmackDown after Fast Lane. Is that in here? I think so. I've got a list at home. Yeah. Well, Sasha Banks is back in inch one. I can't remember if we told you that. But, um, but they did. Yeah. So that means I lost. Yeah. So you've got to shove the marshmallow in your gob. Bam. I can put, see how many of them fit in my mouth. But. I'm not very good at it. I'm really worried I'm going to try. Oh, yeah, just has to choose to put one in. No. <laughs> I'm so confused. I've got as many as it fit. Oh, my God. And then carry on. Oh. I can only do three. <laughs> I regret agreeing to do this. <laughs> yeah, I can't remember. Look at him, he's sick. How are you going to speak? <laughs> this might be a lot. How do people put a time in their mouth? <laughs> Carry on. <laughs> Next we heard Kevin Owens versus Dolph Ziggler for the Intercontinental <laughs> Championship. <laughs> and um <laughs> uh. Don't please don't try, please. <laughs> I can't save you, I've no first aid skills. <laughs> Carry on. Right, so Kevin Owens <laughs> won the championship <laughs> on the Raw before the Fastlane. And he's already defending his championship against Dolph. 
So we had to put the coin, I think. Because we're like, Kevin Owens is definitely going to win this because, you know, he's only just won it. You're right, you can post. I'm good. <laughs> so we flipped a coin and unfortunately I got Dolph. <laughs> Not that bitch. <laughs> Who did you get? Kevin Owens. <laughs> I just wanted to make a <laughs> <laughs> Um, to be fair, I'm not quite sure I liked the match. I no, I sure. thought I'd seen it a thousand times already. Mm-hmm. Dolph did better than normal. Yeah, to be fair, Dolph did better than normal. But, but I feel like Kevin Owens is bored. Mm. Oh yeah, he's definitely bored. I don't think he can expand his character on this. No. And, um, one well, something he does in his feuds, he expands his character. He does more with it, and this one is just... He hasn't changed. Yeah. He's a bit like a Dean. He likes to expand. Mm. So yeah, disappointing match. But Kevin Owens was still champion, so I don't care. But I lost. So yeah. I don't know what's happened with Bray Wyatt. God, yeah. He hasn't done anything. He's so useless. Do you know mm. Every time I see him, I think, oh, go away. Like, mm. it's just so irrelevant. He was so good. Bray was so good. They ruined him. They did. They ruined him ever since, like, after he lost against the Undertaker. He wasn't the same after that. Mm. Mm. Last bit of my friend, I know. Yay. I feel like I've done a bush type of trial. <laughs> mm. oh. You're gonna have to take the wheel while I like stuff my face. Oh shit, then. Alright, so next. Oh, talk Bray Wyatt. <laughs> we have Bray Wyatt, the Wyatt family versus Big Show Bray back in Kane. Why did that ever put fruit in your mouth? Huh? I've got a little mouth. I can't even put mine through. <laughs> don't choke. <don't> <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. so, <laughs> so I went for I went for Big Show Ryback and Kane because I said that I trust Kane and he's my friend. Mm. So that means you went for the Wyatt family. It right. wasn't a coin flip, was it? Mm. No. Okay. So uh, I was annoyed. <laughs> wow. Uh huh. It's really powdery, isn't it? Mm. Mm-hmm. I'm really worried it's going to give me two fake. Anyway. We're not doing this one again. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, I I was annoyed that Bray Wyatt didn't even wrestle in this match. He didn't do fuck all, did he? He's got the yeah. in there. <laughs> I struggled to do what? I think you need to have three more. Yeah. Well, I was like, I could put a fourth one in, but I couldn't. I'm not sure if it would fit in. <laughs> I was like, I don't know. I don't know. I I might try and fit a fourth in next time. <laughs> I'm actually quite like tempted to see how many I can fit in my mouth. We'll do it at the end. Right, anyway. Cool. Have a bunny. Have a bunny. <laughs> Sorry, I, um, I interrupted you mid-flow. I can't remember what I was saying. Uh, brain never got in the match. Yeah, Brain never got in the match, but I was super annoyed anyway. Because the selling point of the Wyatt family is fucking Bray Wyatt. Yeah, but he doesn't fuck all anymore. I'm starting to think he's injured. I, don't, like, I know he's done a little bit, but he hasn't... He's got issues, man. Mm. He doesn't do anything. I'm wondering what he's up to. I'm wondering because I don't care about the rest of the Wyatt family all I care no. about is Bray no. when Bray's being shit I don't care about any of it Braun Strowman can go fuck himself and go <laughs> home uh, and Luke Harper and Ed Ryan can be a tag team and do their own tang other than that what? I'd love to see you say that someone in person go fuck yourself and go home <laughs> <laughs> go fuck yourself go home go home it was, it was go home bit that just killed me <laughs> yourself and go home. <laughs> um, yes, Ashley. <laughs> <laughs> something I can't remember. This match was fucking awful. I, mm. I think I fell asleep and didn't bother. Yes, I did. I fell asleep and didn't bother re-watching it. <laughs> I can barely remember. I woke up for the end and thought, I don't care. So <laughs> I watched Fast Lane Life, didn't I? Yes. Yeah! That's how long I watched it. Uh, yeah, I barely remember this match. It's no shit. It was so pointless. I didn't. I didn't even know why it was a match. That should have been pre-show, and the championship Alberta yeah. Rio thing should have been a normal match. It's a championship match. I don't see why it was pre-show. I feel like it got saved from being pre-show because it was Big Show and Ryder uh, and Kane rather. Yeah, but why were they attacking? Just, just, just. I've got to stick more in my mouth now. Oh yeah, enjoy. Because yeah, White Family lost. Oh, I don't know if I can fit four in. I think that's a bit ambitious. Yeah, just do three. We don't want you to choke. No. I'll still upload it on YouTube for your memory. We'll use it as a warning for the Chubby Bunny game. <laughs> it's like, I'm it's like... I'm not fit in here because I'm not <laughs> it's, it's like the whole, uh, 
He's a trained athlete. <laughs> do not do this at home. <laughs> These trained YouTubers do not do this at home. <laughs> you just went to the dentist and everything. I mm. know, oh, I feel like it's ruining your teeth. That's why I got them clean. Oh, they feel like smooth. Mm. Yeah. I screwed this like five times. Did I? <laughs> yeah. Right, so. Next match was Charlotte with Ric Flair versus Brie Bella. Um. Now, for some stupid fucking reason, we both thought it was going to be Brie. It's what they do with Championship to be fair. Yeah. And Daniel Bryan just got like, retired, so we thought, oh, there might be like yeah. a sympathy championship. <laughs> sympathy championship. Yeah, we both thought it was Brie, but we had to put the coin. Mm. And, uh,. Oh, I got. Oh, for fuck's sake! I got Brie. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! I don't know if I can take anymore. <laughs> you made them so fast. <laughs> Do it. It's the powder that gets you. It's yeah, like the cinnamon yeah. challenge. You just can't. Your mouth goes all like gooey. Yeah. Well, you still like survive the win in my hand. Oh. <laughs> this guy's wait till you watch it back. Wait till you watch it back. I don't think we're gonna be able to eat marshmallows for for a while. No, this. I. Oh. <laughs> Um, um, yeah, the match. I oh, was well, this was shit. Brie did well. I think this she was She did better than normal. Well. She did better than normal. Yeah. But it was, still, it was still not good. She just used Daniel Bryan to get the crowd reaction. Yeah. Like, she's, oh, Michael, God, oh my gosh, she's wearing Daniel Bryan's knee things, my chickies. He's got <laughs> skins. I'm like, oh, I don't care. <laughs> I could care what she's wearing. She'd be wearing his fucking skin for all I care. Yeah. I could have care less. <laughs> right, that's nice, Brie. <laughs> yeah. Go fuck yourself at home. <laughs> I just hate Brie. I just, oh, it's like about her. Every time mm. she does that like, smirk or yeah. says something that like, stupid voice. Brie. 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 That's the only good thing about her. I and mean, then even that's annoying. Yeah. That's the most annoying thing ever. The thing is, you can't help but go, Brie. Yeah. You're like, no. <laughs> Why doesn't she say it like that when she goes, Brie. She should go, Brie. <laughs> <laughs> I said this is not aggressive. <laughs> Be more fun to watch. It would be more fun to watch. <laughs> she went, Free love! Yeah. It's more, it might actually be more scary because she's being nice than she's whacked someone in the phone. Exactly. It's all about the mental mind game. Yeah. It's all about the mental. Yeah. <laughs> it's all about the mental. Yeah. I'm sick of Charlotte being champion, to be fair. Oh, so I know. Yeah. It was good at first. But like she's shit. And no, then it was just not... like awful. No, she's not shit. Ric Flair makes her shit. Mm. Ric Flair makes her unbearable. The second Ric Flair turned up, it ruined her. Yeah. Agreed. Agreed. She could be a better heel without him. Oh, yeah. But she's lost the ability to talk. Have you yeah, she's that? all very monotone. And then try to be so sarcastic and it doesn't work. <laughs> it just sounds like she's talking down to like a two year old. Like, you are gonna lose. Maybe that's the point, the though. The title. Yeah, but she doesn't really bad either. <laughs> she doesn't even talk to a two year old well. <laughs> yeah. She's just, she's just awful. Oh, mm -mm. yeah, go on. are calling your name, Ashley. I hate them. I feel like I hate marshmallows. I don't even eat marshmallows, really. I, I sometimes fancy them, and then I'll eat a couple and be like, Jake, do you want them? <laughs> That's okay, puppy. <laughs> oh my god, I had McVitie's bites yesterday. Oh. They're like little balls of bites. Digest chocolate digestives, but they do like caramel flavour and that's had a caramel one. Oh my god, it's gorgeous. They better put some in the Degusta box. They better. I've paid for the next Degusta box. Mm. Mm. They just it hasn't put, said it's packing yet, which is worrying me because it should be packing by now. I'm worried. Mm. Anyway, next was a Roman Reigns and Dean Ambrose backstage segment that I don't remember. JJ mm -hmm. asked Reigns, what's their relationship like with Dean? Will it ever be the same again after tonight? Probably. Uh, he's like, we're brothers, but when we're in the ring, we fight. That's basically what he said. But Which is pretty much what they said like ten times. Mm. Yeah. So, yeah. Ow! <laughs> what did you do? I like, punched myself. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and then and was like you know what we're gonna come together we're gonna beat the beast we're gonna beat each other he's like i've heard this a thousand times i could literally repeat yeah. the lines for you and then uh that's it they're like them like you know like woody from toy story so the pool string 
He's yeah. like a toy like that. It just repeats that conversation. Yeah, both of them. We are brothers. We will win. We play together. But we will fight in the ring. <laughs> it's like, that's like all they do. Someone is literally standing behind them pulling a string. Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> it's because you've had so many marshmallows. That's like nine. Like, it's, it's, it's five right. seconds, not five I'll seconds. I'll have the next spot. <laughs> Next we have Chris Jericho vs AJ Styles and we flipped a coin because <laughs> we both want AJ but fuck you Coral because I we got AJ. We don't even know. I, I know it. in my soul I got AJ. <laughs> <laughs> Too bad, I think I did say Jericho. I think you did. Yeah. Good Jericho. So, yeah. But, okay. anyway, ma the match. The match. The same as the other two matches. I it was exactly the same. Apart from the end was a bit different. Yeah, when they shook hands and then... They become a tag team, which is weird. Yeah. That ruined it all, all for me. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, should I go three white ones or a pink one and two white ones? Pink, two white, that's what I do. Um, yeah, and it just went on for a while and I was kind of bored. I was like, I've seen this loads of times. Yeah, it's a bit shit. Everyone knew they were going to end up being a tag team. I, I thought it was quite obvious they were going to end up being a tag team. Did they? Yeah. I think I said it on one of our reviews. Did they? a tag team, yeah. Not a member. <laughs> I was struggling, I thought we'd turn that up. <laughs> How do you do that so far? I shove it in and chew. And then it's gone. You have to open one more. <laughs> Maybe you need to open your throat. <laughs> <laughs> have you got a gag reflex though? Yeah, because I haven't got one. Mm. So I think that's why my mouth can handle it. I also can't eat like that. Yeah. Like, no sugar is in my heart. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so glad it weren't me this time. I needed a break. <laughs> <laughs> While you're doing that, we had the cutting edge peep show with New Day on it. You thought this was shit? I didn't find it funny. I thought it was cringe. It was very important. And then it wasn't long either. It was like five minutes. And then, like, you know. Peep, Edge, Peep, whatever they're called, Edge and Christian. <laughs> Edge and Christian talk, and then New Day say something, and then League of Nations come out. Why? 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 <laughs> Don't do this. I literally thought, why? Even the crowd were like, no. Like, the <laughs> boos were like, no, boos. They weren't like, boo. They were like, no. Why? Like, you're ruining my evening. It's so gross. And then New Day and Edge and Christian like tag against. League of Nations and they're like bitch pairs and it was just sort of weird. And the conclusion at the end of it was nothing really. They did some boot shakes and walked off. I feel a bit like with Penn and Teller. You know like Penn does all the talking and Teller just goes. <laughs> you don't know Penn and Teller are? No. A magician. Oh. Mm-hmm. Penn. He's like really tall and he's got glasses and the curly hair and ponytail. And Penn is like quite short and he doesn't speak. He just kind of goes. <laughs> Who's that? Who are you referring to? Penn and Teller, because no, I wasn't no, speaking. Oh, 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 Except for Roblox and have a random match, but nothing happened. <laughs> nothing happened. Oh, nothing. <sighs> it was all just very pointless. And then we had our truth versus Curtis Axel, right? We couldn't even predict it because we didn't know what's happening. I don't know why oh, it yeah. happened. Everyone was like, why is this a match? It's like they had to run, they were like, shit, we've got time. <laughs> <laughs> grab them, oh, yeah. grab them now. <laughs> but to give them credit, it was, decent it was a good match, mm. you know? I forgot about it, but yeah. It was a good match. I remember sitting there thinking, actually, this is pretty good. I think it's also nice just to see them. You know, Curtis actually Axel. have a match. I have a new fun love for him. He's underrated. He, he is so, very underrated. Yeah, he's very good, you know. Mm. He can talk that as well, which is good. He's mm. not just like... I feel like he can bring himself up to like, the Intercontinental Circle. Yeah. Easy. Unfortunately, uh, I think his gimmick lets him down a little bit. Yeah. Drop the gimmick. Let him be a bit cocky and ballsy like he is. I think he needs to be like that brash, like wear a suit, like, oh yeah, I'm like, got his <laughs> limos, I've got these chips, like, you can't mess him, I've got the money. Like, I think he, he would suit that if he did his hair different. <laughs> I don't know why his hair matters. Maybe he could do the big jock, kind of. I'm, oh yeah, I'm like, a dick. I'm a rugby player, yeah. not rugby, like, American football player. Yeah. 
Like, I'm a dick, and I'm like, yeah, you're not a money bitch. Yeah. Like, I don't know. Yeah, I'm better than you. He couldn't be faced. He definitely couldn't be faced, but... They no. need to give him Like, not dressing up as fucking Hulk Hogan is going to be you no know, nice. <laughs> But he's good. He's good. And I don't know if they don't give him credit because maybe, cause obviously, when his dad was a wrestler as well. Yeah. Maybe they don't want to do that. Maybe. How did his dad finish with WWE? Was he on good terms or? Ah, no idea. Yeah. So it makes you wonder, like, maybe. Because obviously, Ric Flair's on good terms, mm. therefore. Charlotte's not there, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. 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 I've seen, I've seen the Raw, NXT, SmackDown, Raw, NXT. I'm just thinking, yeah, I'm just thinking the same one, okay. yeah. Oh, yeah, so mm -hmm. Um, yeah, so Goldust come out during this match, and the crowd were, like, are chanting after uh, Golden Truth, but the thing is, no one gives a shit now, because they've missed their timing. Yeah, And, like, okay. no, everyone's over it now, because they're like, oh, well, you took too long. Yeah. Which is what happened with Goldust and Stardust. Why did they do that to Goldust? They fuck his timings up all the yeah, time. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I don't understand. If a crowd's interested, you fuck it, push yeah. it forward. Like, but they don't. <sighs> they don't. I think it's just common fucking sense. I just don't understand. Yeah. Start as a silly. They, they, like, they like to write in Roman Reigns every other scene, so. Just... Oh, my phone even hated that. <laughs> no, suicide jump. It's so bad. Um, Goldust comes down to the ramp and everyone's like, ooh, but he, he interferes. And it costs our truth to match. Yeah. It's a quite sexy one. Yeah. I suppose that's quite good for the social outcast, but then mm. again, when you put our truth and um Curtis Axel against each other, it's anyone's game really, isn't it? Yeah. So they're both used as a punching bag. I was like, they're gonna start doing a dance off again. I just don't know. Yeah. I just don't know. I just don't know. Um we then had the last match of the evening. It was the triple threat or the normal contender match. No. I said that wrong. It was a threat for the number one contendership for the heavyweight championship at WrestleMania. That's a mouthful, isn't it? Yeah, it's quite a mouthful. I feel like what I'm going to have to do anymore. And, uh, <laughs> that's, that's so fun. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, we both go. Could we both look? Oh, yeah. Um, oh, that's going to be fun. So we review it first and then we can yeah. do the goodbyes. <laughs> so, I, we both went for Dean, I think. We had to put the coin. So, I got Dean. I got, I I'm a Brock because yeah, I believed in Brock. <laughs> yeah, you did. You know, I don't know why, but I believe in Brock. <laughs> I believe in Brock. I miss Brock being around. I feel like Brock needs to beat up Reigns so much that he had to leave. Yeah. Triple H tried it, but he didn't Foul. succeed. He failed. He just made him get a bloody nose. Oh, Fuck you, one. Triple H. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck off and go home. <laughs> so catchphrase. Yeah. <laughs> go fucking yourself and go home. Go fuck yourself and go <laughs> home. Please. <laughs> That's why it's like fuck yourself first and then go home. Not go home and fuck yourself. No, you gotta fuck yourself first. Right Bang now, go public. Because you're a knob. You bash yourself first, then you can go cry. <laughs> I don't want to eat a no. No, do I? Um, I've actually dreaded it. I've hated reviewing it. I oh, know, it's hard, isn't it? I oh, know. Um, next time we'll just wear a funny hat. Yeah, I think it's easier. <laughs> Um, <coughs> I've got a bunny onesie now. Yeah, I've got a free stick for work. Because you know, where do you want to bend down? Oh, <laughs> just don't bend down then. I'm gonna have to. Work. Oh well. I know. That's cute. I was just like, I haven't got time to send it back and get a bigger one. Um, so yeah, the match. Do you know what? It was really quick. Thank fuck. No, but. <laughs> <laughs> no, but what I don't understand is if we were running out of time. But uh, like to put Arthur and Curtis X there, why couldn't that match have been longer? <laughs> <laughs> That's why I was like, what? I don't understand. Yeah. What's happening? Yeah. If you look at the timings, if you go when after this night, I looked on Wikipedia for the match timings. Nothing lasted more than twenty minutes. No, nothing. A lot of them were between ten, 10 and twelve. Yeah. yeah. It was really weird. Um, I found this match boring. Of course she did. Roman Reigns was there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but like, I think everyone wanted to see a bit more of everyone having a go at each other, not everyone fighting each other. I mean, and Dean and Roman Reigns kind of giving it proper, like you know. Well, everyone, everyone's waiting for the Dean Ambrose Roman Reigns turn. But it didn't happen. Yeah, they were too soft. And then 
they tag team Brock too much, and they they seemed it was more two against one, if anything. Yeah, it and just annoyed me. And the thing is, I think I don't think that turn's ever going to happen because WWE is so reliant on Dean Ambrose to making mm, brains look yeah. good. Yeah. They're never going to turn it. Not until Reigns, like, leaves or whatever. Or, I don't know. But you think, right, it's been, what, over a year and he still hasn't got yeah. through. You why think, are still trying? Well, yeah, why? Why are they still trying? They're, that's why their ratings are going down the toilet and they're losing yeah. money. No one wants to see Reigns. I'm hoping the self Shane thing changes it around. It won't. No. Who will lose? Yeah. And even if he does win, it's still Vince behind it. Yeah. He's just making it look like he's still the bad guy. We must. We heard there's rumours now that Punk's coming back. Yeah, there's there's rumours Goldberg's uh, coming back and all this. Who's coming back? Goldberg. Yeah. Joe's probably gonna come and get involved. With Rock. Well, yeah, because no, he hasn't actually got a book in. He no. said he's at WrestleMania, but he hasn't got well, a book in. Must be that because Shane and Rock have this whole history with it anyway as well, didn't they? Mm. I think it makes perfect sense. Yeah, it does to be fair. Because why else would you pre-book him so early? Yeah. And then he still doesn't have a match, I and mean, we're what, a month away? Maybe he hasn't even got a match, he'll just say some words and leave. What, like thingy last year, Ronda Rousey? Yeah, hello, That I'm was the Rock. most boring fucking thing ever. Uh, I fell asleep. I fell asleep, you know. Like, you did fall asleep? Yeah. Oh my god, it's just the this I can't have my bunny ones in. Oh, it's gonna be so, please don't let it be so warm. It won't. I might even be in a different place. Oh god, yeah. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Jeez Louise. Right, we got to stuff our face. Yes, it's rain fucking one. I really don't want it. I don't want to do it, mommy. Oh, I've got tea. Oh, I've got two pink and white this time. There's four left for you. I'm not having four. Well, I've got one. Oh, 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 i have can we say the phone now? I think it's a lot of stuff. I want to write this thing. You've got to write it. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> what are you writing the asses? Really? No. Let's go for two. Okay. Won't work more than that. Okay. But if you want to like say subscribe, please keep me humble. Please. Can't lie. I'm gonna throw up. Like us, love us goodbye. <laughs> She's gonna throw up now. <laughs>